Okie dokie. Restorative yoga. All right, so we'll start as per usual in our simple seated position and have your little yoga bolster nearby or a couple of pillows. You don't have your bolster, but I know you do, Charlene. All right, let's get started. I'm gonna move it. This closer. All right. You can be in a simple seated position. If you'd like, you can do half or full lotus. If your body doesn't do that, it doesn't do that. Lengthen your spine, rest your hands on those legs, face down for grounding, and then close those eyes and take a nice deep breath in through the nose. Expand the rib cage. And gently exhale that breath. Let's circle the head all the way around. And take another deep breath in. And exhale, reverse that circle. And head back to the center. And roll the shoulders to the back. And then roll those shoulders forward. And then lift those arms out and up. Take a nice deep breath in. And exhale, open. And left hand down, stretch that right arm over the head. And lift up and twist, right hand behind you, left hand on the knee. If you like, you can wrap your right hand behind your back, gorgeous. And release, unwind, reach that left arm out, inhale. Exhale, nice. Long stretch. There's Karen. And then let's lift up and twist. Go ahead again if you like. Wrap that arm. And gently release. Good. Karen, if you have, I don't know if you have a yoga bolster, or if you don't, grab like a couple of pillows, like two pillows. All right, let's straighten our legs out in front of us, lift the arms, inhale. Exhale, forward fold, belly button pulled in. And look up and flex shoulders back and down. And round and point. And roll it up. Good. All right, we're going to take either our pillows or our bolster and just place it on your legs. Yes, and then take another deep breath in, and then exhale. Just fold it over if you can, lay your head from one side to the other. And just lift up and turn your head the other direction. And before we get into our more bolster techniques, let's take it into all fours. Let's just warm up the spine with our cow and our cat. We're going to arch the spine on all fours. Look up, take a deep breath in. And then exhale, pull that belly button up. Drop the hips, drop the head. Try to separate those shoulder blades. Engage the core by keeping the belly button pulled up. And repeat, arch that spine. Look up, inhale. Exhale, pull it up. 
Two more times, arch, look up, inhale. And then exhale, pull up. And one more time, arch, inhale. Exhale, pull up. And bring it back to neutral. Right arm up, open that shoulder, inhale. Exhale, dive through. Good, and if you'd like, drop. And unfold, bring it back to tabletop. Good, left arm up, inhale. Exhale, dive through, belly button, pull up. Good, and if you'd like, drop the right arm behind the back. And release and unfold. And then from here, just pull it back in a child's pose. And then let's roll it up. Alrighty, let's begin with our restorative yoga. So grab your bolster or your two pillows. And then what we're going to do, it might seem a little awkward at first, but it's super comfortable. So we're going to start, and I'm going to time, um, I'm going to time it each way so we get equal stretching on our neck. So you're going to kind of straddle it. So your um, knees are on either side. Yes. And then we're going to just lay our belly on that block, and you're going to reach your arms just over it, and you're going to turn your head to one side or the other. And then we're gonna hold this for a minute. Take a nice deep breath in. And exhale. And take another deep breath in. And exhale. And one more breath. Inhale. And exhale. And just gently continue your breathing. And then just gonna lift your head up and then take it to the other side. And take a nice deep breath in. And exhale. And repeat, inhale. And exhale. And one more deep breath in. Inhale. And exhale. And then you're going to lift back up. This time you're going to take your arms down by your side and then again take your head to the other side and we'll spend a minute here. So just gently work on your breathing. Inhale and exhale. And again, inhale. Exhale. One 
One more guided breath. Inhale. And exhale and just relax. And just take your hands and gently press yourself up. And now we're going to take our legs in like a little staggered position. So my hip is going to go against my bolster. Yes, and then we're going to hug our little bolster. So just reach up, lay your head, and we're going to hug our little bolster for one minute. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more guided breath. Inhale. Exhale and continue breathing on your own. And you're going to keep your legs where you are. You're going to take your head up off of your bolster. And you're going to turn it in the other direction. A little deeper stretch into the neck. And let's take a deep breath in. And exhale. And again, inhale. Exhale. One more guided breath. Inhale. Exhale. gently lift your head up out of that. Hands press into the mat. Gently press yourself up. And then we're going to do the same thing the other side. So put that other hip against that bolster. Good. And then let's lay our chest on that bolster. Arms up. Hug your pillow. And Take a nice deep breath in, lay the side of your head. Inhale. Exhale. And 
And again, inhale. Exhale. One more guided breath. Inhale. And exhale. side and deep breath in and exhale inhale exhale and one more guided breath Inhale, exhale, And then let's slide our legs out in front of us. Yes. And again, let's do our three breaths. Inhale through the nose. And exhale through the mouth. And again, inhale. One more breath, inhale, exhale, and then we're going to bend our knees and place our feet back on that mat. And then you're going to take your hands in front of your chest like a prayer position. You're going to take a breath in. On the exhale, you're going to extend your arms out over your head. 
Good, and then you're going to bring your arms down like a goal post below the body, kind of where that bolster is, and then you're going to bring them all the way down and then back in to that prayer position. Yes, inhale, reach those arms. Exhale, goal post, pull those elbows down. Get a nice stretch around the chest and the shoulders. And then bring it back around to that prayer position. One more time, inhale. Exhale, extend the arms over the head. Excellent. Goal post as you pull the elbows down. And then bring those hands to the belly and just rest. And then let those hands go down to your mat and then gently lift your head and your body. And you're going to take your bottom now down to the mat. And this one is great for um, arching the lower spine. So and more of a deeper chest opener. Good, again, open those arms out from your shoulders. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. And again, inhale. Exhale. One more breath. Inhale. Exhale. And let's take our feet and knees and place them together. And then we're going to butterfly those legs. Open those hips, yes. And again, take a nice deep breath in. This is my favorite position. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more guided breath. Inhale. Gently exhale. You're just going to pull your elbows in towards the rib cage and then place your hands on your mat. Bring those knees together and then lift your head and gently press yourself up. Good, now we're going to take our bolster lengthwise. Good, and this one. You might need to readjust a little bit so my hips come up and again my arms out and you can slide those legs straight, get a little traction in your spine, yes, inhale, exhale, and inhale. Exhale. Inhale.
chat me. Bend those knees. Back in. And then take the bolster so it's under those hips. And we're going to finish with some inversion. So my back is completely on the mat. One leg at a time. We're going to take our feet off the mat and point those feet up to the ceiling and just let those feet relax. Take a nice deep breath in. And exhale. One more guided breath. Inhale. Exhale. And relax. bottom, so sort of bridge, squeeze those glutes, and then let's slide that bolster out, and gently lower our arms, and let's pull the knees into the chest, and then let's take a happy baby. Either grab around the ankles or under the feet, or you can grab a big toe around, or your index finger around each big toe. If you like, you can rock side to side. And then pull the knees into the chest, and then take those feet down to the mat. Let's lift one arm up over our head and roll over onto our side. Yes, and let's take a recovery breath. Inhale. And exhale. And one more breath. We're just finishing up, Sumaira. Inhale, exhale, press into the mat, start the legs, and walk it back up. Good, and we'll finish how we started, either a simple seated position, or you can take your half or full lotus, and sit up nice and tall, and let's rest the hands on the legs. Close those eyes if you like, take a nice deep breath in through the nose, fill your lungs with oxygen. And let's hold that breath in. And gently exhale all that breath, closing the rib cage. And again, inhale through the nose, expand the rib cage. Hold that breath in. Gently exhale all that breath. Close the rib cage. And last breath. Inhale. Hold that breath in. Exhale. Let's gently circle the head all the way around.
And take another deep breath in. Exhale, reverse that circle. And head back to the center. And let's lift those arms out and up. Last breath, fill the lungs with oxygen, palms together over the head. Exhale, pull it down. Prayer position, let the thumbs rest in the center of the chest. And hinge forward just slightly with the upper body. Place the thumbs between the eyes. And let's bow our heads forward. Namaste. Have a beautiful night, ladies. I'm so sorry. For some reason, I thought it was 6.30. I felt so bad. I'm like, oh, no, she's coming in. It's the end of class. Yeah, I thought it was.